Hi everyone, it's Kayla, welcome back. So today I have a fashion box to share with you. We are going to jump right in just like normal, but before we do, really quickly, Fashion did up their styling fee. So it was $15 to get a box, now it's 20. So I wanted to let you know that before we jumped in. All right, so I know what's in here because they send you a preview and you can accept uh, items in your preview or you can tell them, eh, not really for me. You know, the first time around, I just accepted everything. There's some pieces in here that I'm very excited about and there's a piece or two that I'm like, mm, not really my style, but let me try it and see what I think because you know what? Sometimes pictures don't do the items justice. It's so hard to tell. All right, I know, I said we're gonna jump right in, so let's do it, hang on. Okay, so first up is the kimono. This is by Chris and Carol. It's the Kayla print kimono. How fitting. <laughs> All right, so it's $39. It's 100% polyester. No size on here, though. I'm assuming it's an extra large. You know, I was hopeful for this kimono. I'm just not sure. I'm a kimono girl. I love my kimonos. I do think the print is really fun. I like it. I just don't know. Is it too short? Am I saying something's too short for me? <laughs> I think it might be. I don't know. So I have it on with black jeans and I put a black tank under. I love the print and I love the feel. Even though it's polyester, it's kind of got like a little bit of a silky feel to it. It's really nice. Um, I like the arm length. I'm wearing kimonos a ton right now. I'm wearing them all the time. I really think they're a good transition piece from the warmer weather to the cooler weather. And here in Connecticut, you wake up and you know, it's freezing. It's like winter. It gets a little bit warmer in the morning. And then by afternoon, we, we gotta we gotta get our tanks. <laughs> and then it gets cooler again. So we really experience like three to four, you know, seasons in a day. So Anyway, I do like this kimono, but I just don't know. Let me know if you think it's too boxy. Maybe it's too boxy looking. I love. I, I want to love it. I'm going to watch back and see. My first thought was it's a little bit too short and it's a little bit too boxy. I almost wish it was a little bit longer. You know, let me show you the back of it. It is longer in the back. Actually, I do like it. Let me know what you think about it. All right, I'm going to change into the next piece. Okay, so this top is by Renee C. It's the long sleeve surplus top. It is $40. The fabric is 96% viscose and 4% spandex. I almost slipped my mind. <laughs> I could not find the size. I couldn't find it on the tag. I couldn't find it on the sheet. I'm assuming everything is an extra large because that's my normal size and we're gonna go with that. So if I can find anything different, I will list it below. All right, so it's a wrap style top. I do love the wrap style tops. This one you could make a little bit more modest if you'd like to, I'd probably keep it the way I had it before because I like to wear necklaces. You all know that, especially this time of year. I wasn't wearing them a lot in the summertime, um, but now that it's getting cooler, I'll be pulling out my necklaces and yeah, I need a little platform to show them off, right? <laughs> so I think this top lends itself to that. So what do you think about it? I really like the color of this top. I think the color is absolutely gorgeous. Let me know what you think. Sleeve length is perfect. Now you could probably tell it did come to me a bit wrinkled, so I would have to iron it, but you know I don't mind ironing, so that's no issue here. I think it's a good length. The, to the back is a little bit longer, but you could adjust the length too, you know? All right, I'm gonna show you the back. So I think it's a really cute fall top. Like I have it on with these black jeans right now. I could add some black booties and, you know, make it a cute going out outfit. Or I could change into like my black pants for work and have a perfect work outfit. Wear it with regular jeans too, like your regular blue denim. Yep. All right. So let me know what you think about this top. I'm leaning towards yes for this one. The only thing is I'm noticing it's pulling a little bit here in the shoulder area. Hmm. All right. I'll watch back and see. Let me change and I'll be right back with the next top. Okay, so does this top look a little bit familiar? So I think it was last year, maybe in the winter time, I received this top from Fashion. Let me tell you what it is. It's the Chris and Carol Print and Solid Baseball Top, $41, 95 poly and 5% spandex. So in her note, she says that, okay, she I received it in a previous box and I had left feedback that I liked it, but it was too snug. So she sent it in a larger size, but again, I couldn't find the size in the tag. <laughs> I don't know. I know it's not me. It's not me. I promise. It's not there. Look, it's not even on here. Just the prices. 
They give you three prices, which I really like because if you keep three to four items, you get 25% off. So I like that they give you the price for that. Five items is 30% off, which is a really nice discount. So what do you think about it? I do like this top. I love the colors of this top. Similar to the color, a little bit deeper of a burgundy than the previous top though. I do really like it. You know, I'm thinking this would be a good top for like Christmas morning with some black leggings. Might be, right? Even Christmas day, I could throw on the black jeans. I know I'm thinking so far ahead, but you know what? It's gonna be here before we know it. Scary, right? <laughs> All right, so what do you think about it? I like it, I just don't know if I love it. Hmm, I know, they sent it to me again. It does fit better. I'll have to go back to that old video to see how the other one fit. But I think this one fits nicely. Are the arms a little bit big though? Sometimes the arms like look funny to me, like it almost looks like it's twisted, but it's not. You know what I'm trying to say? All right, let me show you the back. So it's definitely cute. I'm just not positive. You're gonna help me out. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, next type is by Gilly. It's the J'adore long sleeve knit top. It is $53. Ooh, that's pricey, huh? 65% polyester, no, 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 no. 65% acrylic. Yikes, my friend Linda Roy is gonna tell me that acrylic. <laughs> and then 35% nylon. It is a really cute top. What do you think about it? You know, at, when I first, this is one of the ones when I first saw, I'm like, mm, I don't know if this screams Kayla, but you know, I think it's so cute. I love that there's a, some distressing, I'm calling this distressing because it's here on the wrists and it's also on the hemline of the top. Like there's little kind of, we're gonna call it distressing. I don't know if that's what they wanna call it, but that's what I'm gonna call it. <laughs> You know what, I wish, when I do the recap, I'll show you because I have it on with black bottoms. Now she said this would look really cute with leggings. This I thought was gonna be a no, but I kind of like it. It's very comfortable, but I know I have to remember the fabric too. So sometimes, like Linda says, when you wash it, it just kind of holds the shape that it lays in. You know what I'm trying to say? <laughs> I think it's adorable though. I really, really do. Oh man, I don't know. I'm going to have to watch back and you're going to have to help me out, but it is a little bit pricey. It is. I don't know if I want to pay. What was it? 55? Hmm. 53. Close enough. Yeah. I don't know. The writing is in like a lavender, I'd call it. So it's really cute. And it's, I would call this like a dark gray. Yep. All right. Let me show you the back of it. Yeah, this was going to be like an automatic no, I thought. <laughs> I really wanted to try it. I did. That, something about it told me to try it. And I love, I love that these details on like the hemline and I do. Although I know some of you are probably going to say it looks like, you know, a bear attacked me. <laughs> Once you see what it looks like, but I'll show you in the recap. All right. I think I've got, what do I got? One more thing to show you. So I'll grab that and I'll be right back. Okay, so I really wanted to love this top, but I don't think I do. Let's talk about it. It's by White Birch. It's the Stella Waffle Knit Top. It is $38. This one had a tag. It's a large. Again, what am I missing? Oh, material. So the material is 96% rayon, 4% spandex. So I thought this was going to be a unique top. It is a unique top. We'll give it that. I just don't know about the neckline. So sometimes rounded necklines are tough for me to pull off. Yeah, you see, you can see my bra strap. This is very wide too. I almost wonder if it's like meant to be off the shoulder a little bit for that kind of look. I don't know. For me, it would fall off the shoulder whether I wanted it to or not, you know? It has, um, it's not fully lined with this color, but right here, can you see on the bottom? Um, it just has, it's almost, I don't, it's not really a true cognac color. We'll call it beige tan um but it's a kind of like a peeping out look you know what i'm trying to say almost like a layered look but you're not wearing anything else underneath so i was hopeful because i thought it was so cute throw it on with like a similar colored booty i don't know but i just don't think it's flattering on me it is a waffle knit can you see that i think it's the neckline and i think it's a little boxy maybe that's just me the sleeves are a little bit big and they came cuffed and let me see. Yeah, they're stitched. Yep. So they're stitched. You can probably pull that off if you wanted to. I wouldn't. Let me know what you think. I was kind of, I was hopeful for this top because if 
thought it'd be a really cute fall top and something different to add to my closet, you know? Not a bad price either for a top like this. Let me show you the back. And then the sides, can you see it kind of slits on the side, on each side? I wouldn't wear it with black jeans. I just tried it on with black jeans just for ease of trying on because I've got a lot of filming to catch up on. Oh my gosh. You guys are going to get sick of me. It's going to be like a marathon, Kayla, clothing. I've got some other things to mix in in between. So yeah, buckle up. <laughs> You're going to be with me for a while. <laughs> so I got to play catch up. All right. Anyway, yeah, I don't think I'm going to keep this top, although it would be kind of a cute look. What do you think? Let's try to pull it down and see. I don't know. Nah. All right. I'll be right back. We'll do a quick recap. Okay. So I promised you I was going to show you the hemline of this gilly top let me let me find where it is hang on so see here yeah on the back side and a little bit on the front too it's got those kind of cutouts that's where I think some of you would say Kelly you look like you got mauled by a bear <laughs> but what do you think I mean this top's really cute it is pricey though this is the priciest top in the box yeah can you believe that that shocked me um the only reason why I'm hesitating it is really cute and it would be a good like casual cozy top the reason why I'm hesitating is because of the material. I just fear that when I wash it, it'll never be the same. You know what I mean? And I just, like I, I tell you all the time, I wash my clothes in cold. Well, let's see what the care is. Let's read that. Because I, I just tend to wash everything in cold and then hang to dry. Unless it needs to be washed on delicate, then I'll do that. Hmm. Hand wash cold. I don't know. A hand wash top that's casual I just don't know it's cute but I don't know that I want to pay that much for it so I think the two things that I'm considering are the kimono and the second top I just am not sure about the pulling I don't know if that's a good look so but then this third would get 30% uh, not 30% 25% off so the baseball style top the one that I've gotten twice I just thought about it I'm not gonna be pulling for that top I just know I won't it'll sit in my closet Maybe I'll pull for it once towards Christmas, but I just don't know. It's just, it doesn't scream Kayla. So I'm not going to keep it because I just won't pull for it. And that green top, it won't, no, nope. I was trying too hard to make it work. <laughs> so let me know what you think out of these three pieces. So this top here, um, the burgundy top and the kimono. I'm not sure. You're going to have to help me out. So these are the only three that I'm kind of going back and forth. But this one I might have to knock out. And you guys might have to help me knock it out. <laughs> so I may just end up keeping one of these. So let me know what you think. Thanks so much for watching and for spending some time with me today. I really appreciate it. And I will see you in my next video.